Good morning, good afternoon, and good night. Welcome back to another episode of City Skylines Sunset Harbor DLC. We are here in New York City. We are back again in the city, and we are actually going to build the city. So for today, I would actually like to build the downtown area of New York City. And right here, I would like to build our downtown region of New York City. All right, let's get going. So now this is going to be our city center. And I know it looks a little different because usually I do square. Well, I wanted to try this angle or this shape and let's get started. So you guys know what I love to do. I love to grab unique buildings. So for example, I would like to put the cathedral. Is this a cathedral or cathedral of plentitude right here? I think that will look absolutely perfect no issues at all with that then i'd like to put the theater of wonders over here now that does look a little harsh we might be able to fix that then we can put an arena over here just to get sports going so we have our triangle of monuments which you guys know i love to do so this over here is a medium-sized road it's not a large road and i would actually love to build a park in the middle of it so for Give me one second, I need to delete a couple things. Hold on. Okay guys, um, in the comment section below, uh, how do I delete these small trees as fast as possible? Uh, they are really annoying and I will, I don't wanna delete all of them in front of you on camera because that would be a little weird. But all right, let's get going. So what I wanted to do was, I mentioned Biffa did this in a previous episode. So I kinda wanna piggyback on this idea. So this is still gonna be the, tra the trams. So that's not really a big deal, but let's see. We want a tram one-way track from here to the very end. So get that as straight as possible. Okay, guys, so we are back, and I did have to make a slight edit. Uh, we are not allowed to actually build parks on paths. So that was really dumb on my part. So let's get to exactly what I wanted to do now. Uh, we are off to an excellent start, but we're gonna grab a couple small gates. Just a couple of them. Let's see. Side gate, side gate. We'll just keep the side gates kind of uniform and kind of together. Then what we wanna do is grab the side gate over here. Just grab a few of these. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna show you guys what I, I don't, since we're building a downtown area, I'm not gonna show you guys the whole entire park build because that would take a whole episode within itself but for today i'm just going to show you guys we'll build up the park later but for today i just want to show you guys exactly what i'm trying to get out of this there's that so again this is not supposed to be fancy i'm pro i'm going to build up the park probably in another episode but the whole point of this is Okay, we could just do that. The whole point of doing this is to try to get people to use the park. And we're going to put the tram line like right here, the uh, tram stop. And we're going to try to get people to pay to go into the park just to get over to the tram stop. I know that seems cheeky and a little cheap, but that's going to make us a ton of money. So again... We are not building the park for today. We are building the downtown region, but that is just one thing that um, you know I found from Biffa that seems to make a lot of money. And so let's just grab this, go over, so we actually are able to connect over here. There you go, beautiful. All right, so again, we are not building up the park today. That will be another episode, but that's just this is just a way to try to make more money off the parks. And I think it's an excellent idea. And again, Biffa created this idea. I did not, but I th thought it was a fantastic idea and I wanted to add that to my city. Because hey, we, are, we play City Skylines to make money. There you go. So that is gonna be it for that, the park. Now let's start expanding our city center. That's the whole, that is the whole point of this video, by the way. So we were not trying to and actually, I want to put a small gate there so I don't forget. There you go. Okay, cool. So we have that. All right. So the next thing I would like to build is actually really massive, and I've never built it before in my cities, at least 
No, I think I have, but, but I don't think in the... Uh... So I'm going to build the actual Central Park. So we're going to have the entire Central Park kind of going towards our city, or, or the middle of our city. So I kind of really, really like that. Um, it's one of, I, I think it's a great idea. And let's, so before we connect everything up there, let's go back to our medium sized roads with tram roads and let's just blast it off to the side. Like let's keep our, it's kind of like a V. I, I guess you can consider it a V going. Yeah, that's a V, V for victory. I, I, I guys don't, don't harass me about that. I have no idea where I was going with that one. So let's just go over here. And we'll, we need a, we need a tram track to actually, can we go straight across? Then we can kind of fill in, we can go straight across, okay. Then we can kind of fill in our neighborhoods in this area and we can kind of keep everything going. And remember, we're doing high density, so just don't forget that. And what we could do is we can do... I don't know. No, I think we want to do two way. So we we do want the trams to keep going along here, but oh no. Okay, that worked. That worked. That worked, guys. We're okay. We're in the clear. We're in the clear. We're hugging. We're literally hugging the the uh, central park, and we have tram lines going along it. Perfect. Because we want people to actually use this park too. So that is part of the the deal. So we're gonna go back to normal roads. We're gonna use bike path roads, and we're gonna go out to here. Then connect it like that. Then we're going to do the same thing over here. Then go diagonally up like that. So we're going to have some grid use, but at least we have the curve going. If you if you don't know what I mean, um, you could see that there's a curve over here. So we're not getting perfect grids, which is obviously perfectly okay. Uh, somebody in a Facebook group called me out on it because, hey, Sports Monkey, you're against grids, but then you always build grids. Well, yeah, I, I get it. I, I, I get it. But there you go. So we kind of went against the grid. And let's do the same thing over here. And we'll just go up like this, go diagonal like that. It's kind of like it's kind of like we're giving it wings. I don't, oh, I don't know if that makes sense, but I don't know. But it's kind of like wings, I guess. In a way now i would actually like to keep that straight down and what we could do is we can actually put paths in between here and we can make it look a little bit different than um you know just spice it up a little bit so let's grab our paths so this is literally our downtown layout and it i don't think i've ever had an expansion that has been this big uh now if you guys saw my um the canal side the canals that I built a few weeks ago or earlier this week, that is sort of similar, but it is not, it, this is going to be high density. So this is going to be a lot, this is going to be a, it's going to be a lot of people. So we're going to have to add a lot of services and stuff like that. We want that to go straight across. Beautiful. Beautiful. This is turning out really good. I really like this. And I can't forget to put schools in here. That is one thing I cannot forget to do. I probably will forget to do it, but that is just something. And just don't forget these paths, guys. They, especially in a downtown region where we're going to need as much as possible, like transportation wise, just to, just for people to get around because we don't want this traffic to get turned into a traffic nightmare, basically. That is our goal, not to create a traffic nightmare. And so far, I think this should work out really well. We do have trams that we need need to be aware of. So that, that will be a thing, but not yet. So while I'm adding these paths, please remember to like, subscribe, and comment. And what I'm going to do now after adding all these paths, um, we were, we are going, I will add the zoning and I will show you guys exactly what I zone. So thank you guys. Uh, be patient. I will be right back and it'll be about two seconds of your time. And it'll be about, I don't know how long my time.
Okay guys, so we are now back officially and we did let it grow in a little bit and everything is filling in really, really, really nicely and I like the way everything is going for the time being. We do have some towers in there. We do have a long, long, long list of list long a lot of traffic coming into the city and we're getting ready to grow remember we do have some residential that's about to fill in but i did not want to keep you guys waiting and hanging on for so long but everything looks perfect i guess my only question to you guys is um should i get rid of these buildings that the business buildings in the middle of our park um i did fill in the park because it looked really naked without it and I just didn't like the way it looked, so not I didn't no wait, let me rephrase that. I like the way it looked. I just didn't like when it was just empty and we were trying to fill in the city, so I did fill in the park. Um and real quick, let me hit that escape button real quick. Uh Sunset Park. Look at how many people are using it. We have two hundred people have already visited visited the park and it's working out perfectly. Like I said, I wanted to get people from this side. You know, all around this city, I wanted them to walk to the middle and use the trams. And, and that is exactly what they're doing. And that is pretty fantastic, if I do say so myself. So, I really do like the start of our city, our city center. I do like how it's not, it's kind of like a pyramid, I guess. And this is, you know, the cathedral is the top of the pyramid. But if you have any questions, please let me know. I know I have a long way to go to filling in this city. I completely understand that and you know what though this has been this has been a very enjoyable build so if you have any questions please let me know in the comment section below but everything seems to be working perfectly and putting both parks in the center of our city seems to be pretty cool but everything should be working pretty well um ooh, we might need to get rid of that tram stop but besides that everything's working out pretty well thank you guys for watching I appreciate it and uh, have a great rest of your day. And uh, sorry about missing my one video um, from yesterday. I had some major um, computer issues. So thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Have a great rest of your day.